Jackson testified that she never actually saw the man's face that morning or after when she was being questioned by police. In fact, she says it was what he was wearing and how he sounded that let her know the man she saw and the man in custody were the same person. This is David Pennington, the man now held for trial on one charge that he assaulted a Norwin High School student who was awaiting pickup from her school bus the morning of December 10th. The girl testified the man who approached her had a hooded coat and sweatpants on when he came from behind some trees and asked her if she had seen his missing cat. She said no and noted that the man had a strange drawl to his voice. She testified she grew suspicious when he started pacing the road in front of her, quote, I was like, oh God, is he coming for me or back to the pine trees? She said the man then stood directly behind her, quote, his hand went over my right arm and his left hand went up and squeezed my buttocks. The girl screamed and a neighbor came to help just as her bus pulled up. A community alert and subsequent phone call from a resident led police to Pennington, who lives two doors down from the bus stop. The victim said a photo of Pennington's outfit was the same as what he was wearing that morning. And when she heard his voice, she told police it was the same man who spoke to her earlier. The judge kept Pennington's bond the same, but if he posts it, he has to stay outside of 100 feet of the victim and he can't have any contact with her or her family. In North Huntington, Westmoreland County, Ashley Hardway, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.